everyone today i'm going to draw a very important character of the story sleeping beauty and this character is the wicked fairy and the name of the fairy was is maleficent so let's draw this fairy so for that i will draw the circle of the head like this now i will add these horns like on the head in the same way i will draw in the other side also so like this now i will give a pointed point like this and in the same way i will join it from here and in the same way i will join from here to here So the crown of Maleficent is ready. Okay. So now I will draw the face. So I will draw, draw the face of Maleficent. Now I will draw the eyes. So I will start with eyebrows. I will draw two eyes, big eyes. In same way on the, this side also and the eyeballs now i will add a small nose and the mouth because maleficent was not happy so i will make the mouth like this now i will draw the dress so i will make this spike like thing same way on this side also i will draw the spike like this now the collar I will draw the collar and in the same way I will draw the collar of the dress from this side also. Now I will just join like this and from here I will make it a shape. I will make it a shape like this. Uh, now I will just add from here same way she is wearing a big black gown so I will make the big bag black gown like this in the hands she is wearing like this and from here also she is uh, wearing the black gown like this now I will just add same way from here I will just give it a look of the gown so now I will uh, add the hands and here also I will just try to give it a look on add something in the gown so she is wearing a gown In the hands, in her hand, she is holding a magic wand. So I'll make a magic wand like this. So she is wearing a magic wand, and uh, so my drawing is ready. And mostly the gown is actually black in color. So I will color the gown with black color. So this is the gown which she is wearing. I will color it in black color. So I will start with here. And I will start with the head. I'll make some lines like this. I'll color the start from here. So I'll color the crown of Maleficent. She is very she is also an important character of the story. 
so now i will color the gown with black color because she is wearing black color gown and she is a witch of the wicked witch of fairy so witch wicked fairy of sleeping beauty character of sleeping beauty in the same way i will color the this side also so she is the fairy of the bad fairy or in sleeping beauty uh i request you all if you have not subscribed my channel please subscribe it and share it with others also on my channel you can get many videos on drawing i have uh, when i started this channel uh, i started it to draw because i love to draw and then use it for storytelling or some educational purpose so whoever want to love to draw can actually draw uh because it's a very good therapy you really i really love to draw and especially the cute characters where i don't have to use my brain too much and i can really relax by drawing these cute characters so i really like to do all those things and you can also draw and now i will color the mid uh, the rest of the gown so you can just draw like this now the rest of the portion also i will color the gown if you want to listen the story sleeping beauty kindly go through my previous video i have already uploaded the story also and now i am making the characters of this story so you can actually uh, read the story for the kids for your kids and then you can uh, draw the characters to draw these characters i'm already making the drawings you can draw the characters and tell the story to the children i have already drawn many characters and uh, i will draw one more character tomorrow and that is the good fairy that also i will draw and you can tell the story because children love to see the puppets if you will tell the story through puppets you can draw the puppets in front of them they will really love to read the story listen the story and this will actually increase the habit of reading the books and they will get interested towards the book because these characters will make the story book lively for them they will really enjoy reading the stories the main intention is that they should enjoy reading the stories actually okay now i will color the rest of the portion so my fairy is ready and you can also draw it and tell the story to the kids and let the kids enjoy the storytelling and they can also draw puppets they can also you can draw it for them give it to them for coloring so that they will be and then you can uh, see show them in the books how the puppets are used for the storytelling so they will be interested in reading the story and they will get interested into reading the books actually this is to develop the habits of reading in the children okay so i hope you must have enjoyed my video and i i hope you will definitely use this for drawing and use it in your school if you are a teacher or if you are a parent you can use them for storytelling with your kids so uh, bye till my next video